A magistrate has slapped one of Sydney's worst graffiti vandals with the longest jail sentence ever for such a crime. The member of a gang responsible for more than $100,000 damage to public buses and trains has been jailed for 12 months. Seen here in the white mask, Martin Rosa, among a gang that damaged and defaced dozens of Sydney trains and buses. That's good. Hey. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Today, unmasked and in a court dock, the 26-year-old was slapped with a 12-month jail sentence and ordered to pay nearly $30,000 in cleaning costs. I think it's an adequate sentence for the amount of damage caused. We have no comment. These grubs deserve what they get. Uh, quite frankly, we, we've had a gutful of it. Rosa, along with two others, admitted to the graffiti spree that at times was right in front of guards and rail staff. Get the f out of here, you fat The lawyer for Mr Rosa tried to argue that the damage wasn't permanent and the graffiti can be considered art, but the magistrate disagreed, describing it as a crime spree. This disrupts commuters, it leads to trains off tracks, and cost millions of dollars in taxpayers' money repairing the damage. He will be eligible for parole after serving nine months behind bars. Cameron Price, 7 News.